What is up guys? Gian here of Gadget Pilipinas. Welcome back to the channel. At today, pag-uusapan natin at i-unbox ang bagong-bago ni GMA. At ito ay walang iba kundi ang GMA Afford the Box. So ayun, naglabas nga si GMA ng kanilang bagong-bagong Afford the Box. And today, i-unbox natin siya. Uh, I said box a lot of times there. But more importantly guys, at least, meron kayong idea kung ano siya at anong kayang gawin. At syempre, kung bibili man kayo, you want to expect what's inside the box right here, what's inside. At ngayon, pag-usapan natin siya. Let's start with, of course, the box itself. So, as you can see, ito yung pinaka-retail box ng GMA Afford the Box. Um, it says here sa harap, sulit pa sa free additional features. May multimedia player, pwede siyang multimedia player. At meron siyang personal video recorder. So, ibig sabihin yan, kung may mga na-miss kang show, pwede mo siyang panoorin. And also, nationwide emergency warning broadcast system. So, just in case, halimbawa, huwag naman sana lumindol. At saka, yung ibang mga bagay pa na sakuna. Ay, uh, this one has the same thing that would allow uh, the channel and the network to tell everyone what to do in case these things or those emergencies happen. And, Functional Auto On Alert Feature. And here, it also says kung ano yung laman ng box, ano yung warranty uh, ng box, at saka nung mismo accessories included inside. Sabi rin dito sa may bandang likod, panoorin ang paboritong kapuso channels in digital display. So since this one is using digital and HD, we will be able to enjoy, as it says here, uh, the shows by GMA, GMA News TV, at saka yung kanilang Heart of Asia. You know, tagalized telenovelas at mga paboritong drama. Plus, other free-to-air channels in digital broadcast. Sabi nila, mas malinaw at mas makulay na panonood. And they have here, of course, a uh, comparison of how uh, you know, kapag ka ikaw ay naka-afford the box at saka hindi ka naka-afford the box. That's pretty much everything. You know, uh, the features here kind of tells you um, just a quick overview of what these things are. At uh, if ever you have any concerns with the box that you just got, then you can actually check it out right here. Alright, ngayon naman ay tingnan natin kung nilaman ng box. Alright, uh, handa tayo ngayon. Meron tayong gunting. Might as well use this. There you go. Ooh. Okay, so I expected it to be a little bigger. But we have, we have here the remote that would allow us, of course, to control it anywhere. Provided na yung proximity ay swak doon sa, or your range rather, is swak. You have here the remote. Apart from that, we have uh, the video and audio no? cable. So if you're still using this, then yeah, you will, you're freely, uh, you're allowed to use it. Ayun, at meron dito na indoor antenna. Ooh, we'll open this later again. At may kasama siya na battery. Uh, this is a triple A battery, so if you have uh, batteries lying around, then you can use this, provided that it's uh, um, still with battery juice. And then, of course, you have the uh, afford the box. First impressions ng box, hindi siya malaki dun sa inexpect ko, uh, but I don't think that's an issue. Okay. Okay. Ito yung pinakagusto natin lahat eh. Ang galit nito. Remove natin. Ooh, nice. Okay, so right off the box, you can see that there's a power button right there. You can change the channel. So you, even if halimbawa wala yung remote and you want, you wish to uh, switch channels, you can do so manually. There's also a USB drive right here. So if you wish, for instance, to um, let's say um, watch your movies, then you may be able to do so. Gusto ko malaman dito kung yung mga supported na mga video files. Now, the overall plate is covered with plastic. It is up to you if you wish to remove them. Uh, nandito yung uh, QC, no? QC uh, test, yung sticker. So, if you rip off the plastic, damay din pati yung uh, uh, warranty. So, mag-avoid yung warranty mo. Just, you know, just for you guys to be aware of that. Okay. And uh, apart from that, you get here warranty card. Be sure to, you know, write your name there. There is also quick installation guide. So, you know how you can... Uh, install the provided RCA no? and also the provided indoor antenna. 
Yan. So, tandaan lang, no, we have here the audio, left and right, and also the um, uh, video. Now, the uh, in terms of uh, ports at the back, you have here the RCA. We have uh, uh, right and left audio, and we have the video on the, you know, just near yung pinaka-power cable niya. At uh, ang maganda dito, may kasama siya na HDMI. So, if you really wish to enjoy no, yung... Uh, high definition and you have uh, high definition TVs at home which uses HDMI input then you might as well no, make use of that wala siyang kasama na HDMI cable so you know just for you to be aware guys if you have any HDMI cables lying around you can use them no now also meron dito na antenna in antenna out which is provided there's even coaxial uh, you know input here should you wish to utilize that Okay, power consumption is 5 watts according here uh, sa ating GMA Afford the Box. And I think it is time for us to discuss about the things that you need to know. Now, according to GMA, this GMA Afford the Box ay maaaring gamitin sa mga sumusunod na mga lugar. And now you can see it also here in front of you. Sa Luzon, available siya sa Metro Manila, Benguet, La Union, Pangasinan, Bulacan, Pampanga, Nueva Ecija, Tarlac, Patangas, Cavite, Laguna, Quezon, at sa Casa Rizal. Para naman sa mga kababayan namin na nasa Visayas, pwede kang gumamit ng Afford the Box sa Bohol, Cebu, at sa Casa Leyte. In Mindanao naman, you can also uh, use this sa Davao de, Oro, Davao de Oro, and also Davao del Sur, at saka Davao del Norte. So, so far, sa Davao pa lang siya available, but hopefully, ay uh, maging available din siya as uh, time goes on. Right. Now, more things that you need to know are the following things. Compatible lang ibang antenna dito. So, kung meron kang antenna from other digital uh, TV receivers, then you may also use that. And they utilize ISDBT uh, for uh, digital TV. So, just in case you guys would want to use that, go ahead and use your existing um, external or indoor antenna. Tandaan lamang na kapag gagamit ka ng external na antena, dapat lang at least meron kang 10 metro na kinoconsider na taas na sa ganun ay masagap mo ang mga gusto mong mga channels. Now, kapag kabinuksan mo ang Afford the Box at sinaksak mo siya, tandaan lamang na kailangan mong mag-riskan. Ito, riskanning would allow you to find all the available channels for you. And so, yun dapat mong unang-unang gagawin. At kapag kahalimbawa naman ay may mga bagong channels and from time to time meron silang update, then you might as well rescan. Wala namang mawawala sa'yo, i-rescan mo lang. One of the cool things of uh, the GMA Afford the Box dito sa kanyang remote is yung very handy na signal button. I don't know if you can see this right now, but the signal button would allow you to rescan the channels. Nang sa ganoon ay makita mo yung mga GMA channels, GMA News TV at saka yung Heart of Asia. Tandaan lang na ang mga channels ay pwedeng magkaiba-iba bawat lugar, no? Halimbawa, ang GMA 7 ay pwedeng ibang channel sa Abanatuan at pwedeng iba naman halimbawa ang channel niya dito sa Manila. So, but you have to be able to see that and check that when you scan the channels. May kasama din siya na USB. So, sa mga nagtatanong sa inyo, yes, no, meron po siyang multimedia player. So, kung meron ka halimbawa mga music na uh, halimbawa ay meron ka sa iyong USB drive at meron kang mga photos na gusto mong tingnan at mga videos, then you might as well go check this out. Siyempre, isang paalala lang sa mga kaibigan natin, no, wag po tayong mamirata ng pelikula, ng mga music, at kung ano-ano pa. No, ito po ay uh, kumbaga tulong na rin natin para sa ating mga kababayan at sa mga tao na nagpakahi para i-produce ang kanilang video or music. Ngayon, isa pa sa mga pinaka-cool na gusto ko dito and I think uh, it really sets this really different among other TV boxes or digital TV receivers in the Philippines ay yung kakayahan niya na mag-record ng mga shows. Yan. Okay. Sa pag-record ng mga shows, importante lang na merong kang nakasaksak na hard drive or USB drive na pwedeng kakasya yung gusto mong i-record na show dito. So, ibig sabihin, kung may mga shows ka na halimbawa ay feeling mo ay mamimiss mo, pwede mo ipa-record yan sa iyong magulang o kaya sa kapatid mo. O kaya naman ay kung gusto mo siyang balik-balikan and then i-record mo lang siya para mamayang gabi ay pwede mo uling balikan yung show na yun. From time to time, lalabas ang mga update dito sa ating GMA Afford the Box. At kadalasan ay magpop-up na lang yan sa screen. When you receive some pop-ups or update pop-ups, be sure to update it nang sa ganun ay wala kang ma-miss na mga bagong mga bagay o features on your GMA Afford the Box. Ang GMA Afford the Box ay talagang ginawa para sa loob ng bahay. Pero may mga kababayan tayo na kailangan nilang magkaroon ng 
digital TV receiver sa kanilang mga kotse para halimbawa naman ay i-entertain ng kanilang mga pasahero. If you're going to do this, just be sure na meron kang DC to AC inverter na gagamitin. So, hindi namin ito demo sa inyo ngayon because ako ay walang ganoon ngayon, no? But I'm very interested to try it out. Ito kasing ating uh, GMA Afford the Box ay hindi mo pwedeng tanggalin o hindi mo po pwedeng palitan yung kanyang cord. No? Siya ay built-in dito mismo sa Afford the Box. So again, as I mentioned, if you wish to use this sa uh, mga coaching ninyo, might as well get yourself a DC uh, to AC inverter. Nang sa ganun ay masulit mo siya. At kung halimbawa ikaw ay uh, nasa um, a hailing uh, uh, car na business, then it's one way for you to entertain your um, riders. Tandaan nga lang na ang kuryente yung kinakailangan nito ay 220 volts. So be sure na swak at tama at kumonsulta kung hindi kayo sigurado na sa ganun ay walang aberya ang mangyari. It is not my recommendation though, pero since as I mentioned ay ito talaga ay built para sa bahay. Ngayon, para sa mga nagtatanong, magkano ba ang GMA Afford the Box? Sabi nila, affordable. Sabi nila ay abot kaya. Well, I think they're right there. You don't need to spend more than 1,000 with the GMA for the box because this one costs only 888 pesos. Ito yung one-time purchase niya. I'm not sure though if the GMA will have additional premium options uh, for you guys, but if you wish to get yourself a GMA for the box, available siya for 888 pesos. Now, if you want to know more about the GMA for the box, you can go and check it out at www.gmaaffordthebox.com. This has been Gian of GadgetPilipinas.net. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video.